So guys, should we start? I think. Okay. It's already six five. So now the next topic we have that is about your binary arithmetic. Okay. And under this part of binary arithmetic, we'll discuss about the different forms, how the arithmetic actually performs. So the next topic we have the binary arithmetic. Okay. Now, when we discuss about this particular part of that is called binary arithmetic, we are talking about how we can add the binary numbers. Okay. And as we know that the binary number is always in the form of 0, 1 or 1, 0. Clear. Now, when we discuss about the very first part that is called binary addition. Okay. The first part we'll discuss right now. And as we know that whenever we need to perform the addition operations in the binary number, we have to follow certain rules and regulation. Okay. Now, when I'm just talking about the binary addition, it will actually go in the same direction. How we do in the decimal addition we're talking right now, because in decimal addition, if you see that we always start from the unit column, then we go to tens column, then we go to hundreds column and so on. Okay. And whenever we have any sum, which is greater than or equal to 10, we actually go for actually a particular decimal place, sorry, unit place on the, on the answer. And the tens place actually will go to the carry forward. That is called the carry forward numbers. Okay. So whenever we discuss about the binary operation, it is basically in the similar way, how we perform the, uh, we could say decimal operation. So first of all, when we discuss about the addition of binary numbers, let us suppose for example, we have input values. And we have output values. Fine. So if, for example, we have two inputs, let us suppose that is X and Y and output, we have the sum and uh, we have carry forward. That is carry. That is called C. That is called sum. and X and Y are the input values. Now the combination of binary would be, I think four types that is zero, 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 one, and one, zero, and one, one. Clear. This would be the basic four values which we have for the binary numbers. Clear guys? Okay. Now important thing comes arise that whenever we have to add zero plus zero, it would be zero, I think only, and there would be no carry. So in the case of sum of zero plus zero, that would be zero and zero, zero plus one, sum would be one. There would be no carry one plus zero. sum would be one. There would be no carry, but whenever we are going for one plus one, one plus one, your total should be zero and carry should be. So that is a very basic operation we need to try to understand now. Whenever we are talking about the binary addition, the binary addition is basically getting performed in this particular way. Guys, it's clear. Zero plus zero, zero would be sum and carry would be zero. That is called carry over. And zero plus one, one zero, one plus zero, one zero, and zero, one plus one, it is zero is sum, and one would be carry. So is it like a thumb rule, sir? Yeah, we can say. Okay. Let's note down this part and then we'll start a few questions of that. So we'll start with the first example. Let us suppose we need to add two binary numbers that is one, 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 one and one, zero, one, zero. Okay. So if we have to add these two numbers, how to perform that task, we'll just discuss right now. First of all, you just tell me these are binary numbers first of all. Okay. 
there is a decimal number of this place. First of all, decimal number of one 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 and one zero one zero. So decimal number of one 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 one. Yesterday I think did this. So fifteen. Fifteen. Yes. Correct. What about one zero one zero? N. Yeah, it is ten. Yes, correct. Then everyone, one 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 is fifteen. One zero one zero is ten. Anji. Yes, students. It's clear. So now we'll perform these operations. Okay, one. That is one, 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 and one. I'm going mean to add one zero. Sorry, one. Zero, one, and zero. Okay, so we are going for binary addition. Fine. Okay. So. Guys, please kindly mute yourself. Okay. So now, guys, if we are just adding this number, first of all, we need to apply the rules which we have mentioned earlier. Okay. So first of all, starting from this one plus zero. One. One. One plus one. Zero. Zero. And carry one. Make sure. Okay. So carry would be one. Definitely. Then, then we have one plus one zero. Okay, that is zero. But carry would be one. That would be forward. Okay, and zero plus zero is zero. Okay. Yes, sir. Again, there would be a one carry. That is one. Okay. Fine. Now yes, one plus one zero. Okay, but zero plus one zero. Sorry, one. one. Okay, and one carry would be forward over here. So this would so be. So there will be no carry, no sir. Pardon? No, no. Actually, the the carry which we have, we write down oh, for that one plus one, sir. Yeah, one plus one it is zero uh -huh. one. So zero plus one is one, and this one carry would be written over here. Okay, sir. Okay. Okay. Understood, guys. I think. So, can you please give me a minute to copy this? Yeah, sure, sure, sure. Please take your time.
If it is done, we'll start the next question. Double one, double zero, double one. So actually, the answer is uh, double one, double zero, double uh, one is uh, what is it, sir? Pardon, which part? The last thing uh, you have highlighted, no, sir. This is. Ah, yes. This is the answer double one, double zero, one. So what do you call that as, sir? It is the final number. Actually, Sorry. If you if you will just add this fifteen plus twenty ten, that is twenty five. Yes, sir. Okay. So, so this the binary number of uh, sir, the decimal is twenty five, sir. Yeah. Okay. Decimal twenty five, binary of twenty five, double one, double zero one. You can cross check as well. Ah, okay, okay, sir. Okay, you can cross check as well. This should be double one, double zero one of twenty five. Let's cross check once. I think this double yes, one, double zero one, should be twenty five. Yes, I checked it, sir. Okay, now you have to add these four numbers now. Just copy this. Try your end first. So what to do now, sir? You have to add these four numbers now. Right now we have only two numbers. Yeah, yeah, sure. Now we need to add four numbers. Okay, pretty much answers. Guys, done. Shall we wait?
So one zero triple one one zero. See, first of all, convert into decimal all these numbers. What is the decimal form? Yeah, better would be I think uh, the better way to go for I think so that we can cross check the answers as well. Okay, go for decimal of double one double zero double one first. Fifty one, sir. Yes. Fifty one. Fifty one. Fifty one. Fifty yes, one. Yeah. Then double one double zero one zero. Eighteen. Eighteen. Correct. One double one double zero. Twelve. अरे ट्वेल वन नो नो डबल वन डबल जीरो ट्वेल्व ट्वेल्व या ट्वेल्व एंड वन जीरो वन फाइव नाउ मेक शर द आंसर विच यू गॉट आई थिंक इट इज नॉट करेक्ट फर्स्ट ऑफ ऑल सो मेक शर The decimal total should also equivalent to the binary which we are getting it out. Ah, okay, sir. Okay. So that is eighty six. Yes, sir. Okay. So your answer should be eighty six. I think so. One, one, zero, zero, one, one. Then one, zero, zero, one, zero. One one zero zero. One zero zero and one. Okay, so this should be the form to write the answer. Okay. Now please try it once. Yes, and tell me the answer. So one zero one zero double one zero. One zero one zero double one zero. Hmm, correct. One zero. Thanks. Everyone got the answer. 
वन जीरो वन जीरो डबल वन जीरो This is going cross check. It is it is it is equal to eighty six as well. Yes, sir. Okay. Guys, done. Yes, sir. Is it clear? I think everyone. Yes, yeah. So next part we have very about the binary subtraction now. Okay. So so binary subtraction is I think almost similar to that only, but the difference is about this particular input, output, and borrow because in our subtraction we always go for the process of borrow the number. Okay. so this sum will replace by differences that is capital d and this will be bot not cal okay so this would be b okay now any guesses please first of all 0001 1011 but now this time we are performing subtraction operation sir everything zero when it comes to zero and zero sir difference also zero borrows also zero yes and when it comes to zero one zero and one Zero and borrow one. No, zero minus one would be difference of. Is it minus one, sir? No, minus would not be part. Yeah. One and one, sir. One and one. Yes. Why? What if the difference is one and one we borrow? That means we are borrowing one to make it a particular operation part. Yes, sir. One minus zero. One and zero. Hmm. And one minus one. Zero. One, sir. No, no. We are borrowing anything? No. No, no. Zero. So zero. Clear. Yeah. 